And on the other side of the continental United States, thousands are stranded in the Nevada desert after severe flash flooding moved through Black Rocks, where the week-long Burning Man Festival is being held. Now, the festival took a deadly turn. We're learning that one person is confirmed dead, and investigations are still in motion as to the cause of his or her death, which remains uncertain. We do want to bring in Fox Weather's Max Gordon. He's live for us from parts of Nevada. And where you're at, Max, you know, what more are you learning about what could have contributed to this death? Yeah, well, we don't know the answers to that right now, Michael, but where we are here in Gerlach, Nevada, this is the first major town just south of the Burning Man Festival. And so we're expecting to see as the day progresses lines of mud laden cars as festival organizers start to open up escape routes for people to to drive out of. Uh, out now, some people have already gotten out via vehicle or some even by foot, but tens of thousands of people remain stranded right now. This after monsoon rains hit the festival, leading to flash flooding. It closed roads around Burning Man, and the Pershing County Sheriff's Office confirmed that they are investigating one death that was reported during the rain event. Officials haven't provided many details about the death, but said the victim's family had been notified. Organizers say that mobile cell trailers have been placed around the event to boost cell signal. Sanitation trucks are now running to ensure portable toilets are clean and that contracted firefighters and EMS workers will now remain on site for two extra days. Fox News senior correspondent and veteran burner Claudia Cowan joined Fox News live from the festival and had to say this about how things were going. Most of us are just hunkering down, making the best of this situation. It's still a fun burning man. There are dance parties to be found. Some of the camps are still open, including ours. Uh, so we're, we're making the best of it, hoping that this rain, and I'm still feeling some drops out here now, end soon and we get our, our warm temperatures and sunshine back. Yeah, and clear skies are expected today. A welcome respite for burners who are now eager to get off of the playa. Uh, but the festival will go on, and the annual burning of the giant wooden man is expected at 9 p.m. tonight. Michael? Yeah, we're just hoping that that rain stays at bay. Fox Weather's Matt Gordon, Max Gordon Force, live in Gerlach, Nevada. Thank you so much, Max. I'm Amy Freeze. Welcome to Fox Weather's YouTube page. We have more great videos on the way, so make sure to subscribe to stay updated on all things weather.